Tonight, a decade and a half long tradition is coming to an end in Cape Coral. This is the last year that Planet Monkman Christmas will shine bright. The Night Beats Justin Case spoke with Neil himself about what this tradition has meant to him. It's Neil Monkman's last Christmas and he's giving his heart to this community. Over the past 17 years, thousands of people have flooded this neighborhood along Northeast 8th Terrace to see this display. It's a labor of love for Monkman, but seeing the smiles on people's faces over the years makes it worth it to him and that is the greatest gift of all. Look at all the lights shining bright. More than 215,000 of them all sync to Christmas music. I get frustrated setting it up, you know, a lot and, you know, but when I see all the kids out here and they're dancing and they're running around in circles and they and they see Santa and they can run up for their candy canes, it just makes it all worthwhile. And crowds of people show up to simmer in the holiday spirit. It makes me feel like Christmas, makes me feel like dancing, seeing those reindeer with their instruments on the roof. I mean, it's fantastic. It's warmer here. It's kind of hard sometimes to get in the Christmas spirit, but this really puts you right there where you need to be, especially when he's playing the Christmas music. There's nothing better. And it's a moment that comes full circle for some families. Monica Evanson came here when she was younger. Now she's bringing her daughter here for the first time. And now I'm bringing out, yeah, my little one. And uh, this is your first time. Yeah. What do you think about it? I like it. People are thankful for all the joy this display has brought to their families, but all good things must eventually come to an end. My wife has some health issues, at, uh, nothing major, but. Um, you know, I'm having to do more around the house to help her and family first. You know, all, you know that, that always uh, always prevails. So it's just uh, getting to the point where it uh, takes up too much of my time. Monkman says it's been great seeing how it's grown over the years. Great seeing all the smiles over the years, and everyone is thankful they got to experience this Christmas creativity. Definitely will be missed. That's for sure. This, there's nothing like the uh, the dancing house. Each Christmas display also raises money for different nonprofits. In previous years, he's raised money for vests for police canines. This year, money is being raised for the Cape Coral Animal Shelter. Monkman says he's raised close to two thousand dollars so far. Also, this display will continue running through New Year. Eve on the night beat. Just in case, Wink News. Uh, legendary tradition. Yeah, it's a great display, <laughs> too. It looks yeah. wonderful. It'll be missed for sure. All right, we'll check this out right here.